You guys, it's a concert day. I'm seeing Olivia Rodrigo today, concert number two of concert season, and I am so freaking excited. We gotta get into the outfit. Top is from Addicted, pants are from Paxson, I think. And then my dunks are from Nike, and we're getting purple, cause look, the album vibes, you know, you know, you know. But I'm here at the Bright Line. My hair hasn't poofed up yet, shockingly. But I'm on my way to Miami. I should get there like 7.30, gonna get merch. Probably gonna miss the opening act. If I get to see some of her, I'll report her for you guys. And then Olivia. Guys, I have made it to Miami. It's 7.30 and my friend already told me that the opening act literally came right at 7.30. So it's gonna take me a 15 minute walk to get to arena. Then probably 30 minutes in the merch line because my friend wanted to get a shirt on the lower level and she didn't want to miss the opening act. So I'll show you guys the merch while I'm waiting to get her merch. And then we see Olivia.
most amazing show know when the hair is up that means the show was a tie olivia rodriguez i'm not gonna lie i'm surprised i got into her because she's not my type of style of pop but i think it's because i was gonna do a breakup when olivia was coming out and i just really needed music i could relate to and now i'm a single and living my best life and i still feel like those songs are so powerful my favorite songs to hear tonight were happier favorite crime and perfect all-american bleep they were so, so, so great to hear live. Um, Olivia is definitely worth going to. If you're into her music, whether you like Sour Guts or both, I would go because she pays a good mix of both. I went with my friend Melissa. We both been fans for the same amount of time and we had so much fun. So if you don't have tickets to the Guts tour, I would definitely go try Box Office same day, try Seeky, try Stuff Up, try something, but it's definitely worth going. Yeah. Thank you guys for watching. See you at Drake in two weeks.